Hello guys, today I want to show you that how we can plot a double y graph on a region. So for this reason, you have a set of data. And uh, for example, I have a data for five samples, one, two, three, four, five, where I have written the sample numbers on this first column, which will be the x axis of the graph. And I have measured the antibacterial activities for these five samples. And I also have the antifungal activities for these five samples. So what I want, I want the sample numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 on the x-axis. And I want to see the trend of the antibacterial and antifungal activities on the same graph. So for this purpose, I use an option which is called as the double y graph. Simply after transferring your data on the origin, you need to make sure that you have set the columns as x and y axis. For example, this one, which is the x axis, is has to be set as set as x axis, and this the second column is the y axis. So I need to right click it and set as the y axis. Similarly, the third column is also a y axis. So I will right click it and set as the y axis. So I have one x axis and the two y axis in this graph. Now I select all these columns and all this data and I go to plot and then I go to multi curve and here we have an option of double y graph. So I click it and here it is. I got a double y graph of the data so that I can see the trend of antibacterial and antifungal activities on one graph and I will not need to make two separate graphs for these two activities. And also you can see here this is the legend. You can do the formatting and increase the size so that you can see the labeling. Usually I go to the properties and remove this background to none like this. And definitely you can also increase the size of the labels. Usually I go for 36 here and 36 here so you can clearly see this is the antibacterial activity values on this y uh, color axis and this is the antifungal activities represented by the blue axis on this side of the y axis so these are the samples number here also i increase the size to 36 and also definitely you can increase the size of these labels and here also i suggest to have 36 number which makes it clear here again i change it to 36 and here it is your graph is ready for presentation thank you